Hello PowerPoint users and welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be slightly different because I am going to introduce you to an application using which you can easily create high quality 2D animations like this. When I reviewed its features, don't think like I am exaggerating but I was just amazed. Let me introduce you to Wondershare Anyreal and using this application you can easily create jaw dropping animated explainer videos. This application is available on Windows operating system and comes with lot of rich customizable assets like drag and drop characters, actions, text, audio assets and built in rich animated templates. You can just drag and drop them to create 2D animations. This application also supports importing your own pictures, videos and audio assets covering almost all formats. There is also inbuilt text to speech feature enabled with deep learning technology and it will help you to add your own voice or scripts into animations and take my words its output quality will just amaze you. There are also entry and exit animations and motion path effects enabling you to animate everything. Turning your scripts into video is one of my favorite features. You can just add your script and any reel will automatically create the animation out of that with one single click. So whether it's for knowledge sharing, sales or marketing presentations, teaching students, training employees or you name any other scenario. Wondershare any real will easily fit into that requirement. So let's download this application by clicking on try it free. Once it gets downloaded, install it with normal procedure and then finally click on start now to launch the application. Now let's explore all its amazing features. So at the launch window of Anyreal, you will see an option to create new project but before that make sure to select the type of screen ratio on the top like 16 is to 9 widescreen, 1 is to 1 Instagram post or 19 is to 16 portrait. Once done, select new project to open up the project window. So this is the project window. On the left, we have important features like script to animation, inbuilt scenes and if you want to create your own custom animations then below assets like background, characters, props, text, music and importing your own assets will be very helpful in creating such custom animations. We will check out these features very shortly. At the middle is obviously the preview window of your animation and at the bottom is the timeline with two tabs on the top. The right tab is for the scene which you are currently working on and the left tab just shows all the scene in sequence. On the right side of the preview window, we have options to create the sequence of scenes using add scene option. You can delete or duplicate a scene using these two options and even you can add the transition between each scenes using this transform option. So pretty much straightforward user interface. Let's next jump into script to animation feature. To convert your custom script into 2D animations, let's open that feature section. Here you will find different type of inbuilt scenarios and you can click on any one to open its scripting window. Here, starting from the title until outro at the bottom, you need to fill up all the fields with the custom script. Say for example, let me type in this script with the title of simple ways to learn 2D animations and quickly fill up all other sections. Once done, just click on generate button at the bottom and then click on OK to start processing your 2D animation. So here is the preview of this animation. Simple ways to learn 2D animations. As we know mastering 2D animations is very important skill, but how to learn it easily. You can learn and master 2D animations using Wondershare Anereal. Anereal is very easy to use 2D animation application and will help you to learn 2D animations pretty easily. Download the application, install it and then go through some online tutorials. You can learn 2D animations pretty easily. That's all about how to learn 2D animations. That's an amazing creation. On the right side, there are total of 6 scenes matching with the 6 sections of the script and they are automatically placed in sequence at the timeline. So that's how you can create animations from the custom scripts. Wondershare Anyreal has lot of inbuilt scenes to meet most of your requirements. You can just select any scene of your choice and then drop it into the preview window. Add one more scene if needed. 
and then drag and drop another inbuilt scene into the preview window. If you go to all scenes under the timeline, you can see both the scenes are now placed in sequence. To add the voice or script, just click on text to speech feature and type in your script. Select the type of language from the drop down, male or female voices or select any of the voices that are available and then adjust the speed and pitch of the voice if required. Once done, you can play it to preview the voice over or you can directly add it into the timeline. Any reel will convert all your script into voice over and then adds it into the timeline. Let's drag it to the beginning of the timeline and then preview the animation. We all know working from office helped to be more productive along with teamwork, cross networking, overhearing leads, positive motivation and accessible help. But because of pandemic, everyone has started working remotely and now that is new culture. We have to adopt to this culture to fight the pandemic. If in case your script extends beyond the animation elements, you can easily adjust all the elements to match the voice over length. Also on the right side pane, you can add the transition between each scenes using the transform option, choose the type, adjust the timing as per your need and that's it. So here is the final preview of this animation. We all know working from office helped to be more productive along with teamwork, cross networking, overhearing leads, positive motivation and accessible help. But because of pandemic, everyone has started working remotely and now that is new culture. We have to adopt to this culture to fight the pandemic. That's perfect and pretty easy to create. So to create the custom 2D animations, we need to make use of assets that are available under each of these sections. Let's start with the background section. You will see there are a lot of inbuilt backgrounds. You can select any background of your choice and then drag and drop onto the preview window. So this will be our animation background. Next go to characters and then drag and drop the character of your choice onto the preview window. You can also add multiple characters as per your need. Under the prop section, let's quickly drag and drop all the assets we need for the animation and don't worry, I will show how to customize each of these elements. Let's add a chart and resize it. Let's go to text section and then add a subtitle. That looks perfect. Under the audio section, we have a lot of music files to add them as a background to our animation. Also there are many sound effects and they can be used for individual animations. Under the import section, you can import your own image using this option. Under the audio section, you can import your own music files or use text to speech feature to add your own voice or script. Let me choose this option and add the script for this animation. Select the voice and then click on add to timeline. Under the video section, you can import your own videos as well. Now that we have added all the animation assets, let's start customizing them one by one. First things first, let's adjust the background as per the script length. Then adjust the subtitle, growth chart, computer screen as per the script length. Since we have two characters in this animation, let's drag and place both the characters in sequence in the timeline and then adjust their length as per the script. So now all the animations are perfectly aligned. Let's start customizing the first character. Let's select it in the timeline and in the preview window, we have the option to flip it vertically. And using the second option of layers, we can arrange the animation elements one behind the other. If you carefully notice, the first character hand is hiding behind the growth chart. So using the layers, we can bring it to front and now the hand will be visible. The third option is for pose. We have many inbuilt poses. We can just click on any one to apply it. For now, let's leave it to hello pose. Using the fourth option, you can apply enter and exit effects to each animation elements. And finally using the fifth option, you can add the motion animation to the characters. Adjust the character position using the arrow mark and the characters will animate between these two positions. Similarly, let's customize the second character, bring it to front using layers and then change the pose type to applause. Let's add the entrance and exit effects as well. Finally, select the subtitle, change the font type, font size and even the font color. So let's set the timeline position to the beginning and then preview the animation. Even due to pandemic, our yearly sales are increasing and the trend is still in the upward direction. Big round of applause for everyone's great effort and teamwork. 
that was pretty easy to create isn't it you can also add more scenes if required and then build the sequence of animations so to export your animations into high quality video just go to export option on the top on the window that shows up give the custom name for your animation decide the save to location adjust the resolution if required and then finally click on export once done click on open the folders and then preview the high quality animation video even due to pandemic our yearly sales are increasing and the trend is still in the upward direction big round of applause for everyone's great effort and teamwork so as we have seen all the important features of wondershare anyreal it's pretty obvious that 2d animations can be easily created using this application so feel free to download this application try it out by creating your own animations and then let me know your feedback in the comment section below thanks for watching and stay tuned